Welcome back, everyone. As we take a look live over the Maumee River, actually a, a few of the scholars out there, I believe. Is that what you call them? The guys that do the rowing thing? Take a live look over the Maumee River, and you can actually see them out there rowing away out there this evening. I think it's a little chilly for me to be out there on the river at this hour of the day, but hey, you got to get the practice in while you can. Uh, skies, more in the way of broken skies now. Less cloud cover. We're seeing more in the way of blue skies. That's going to lead us into a pretty chilly night tonight. Our lows overnight last night were cold enough. Enough. We got down into the low 40s, even some upper 30s uh, showed up overnight last night. Hillsdale made it down to 37, 42 for Van Buren, a 43 in defiance as we started out the day today. But going through the afternoon, numbers did finally make it into the upper 50s in a few spots. So officially, it was 55 for a high at Toledo Express Airport. We made it up to 56 in Holland, 58 for Oregon's high temperature. And as we look at the current numbers, uh, where skies have cleared out earliest up to the north, we're down to uh, 47 in Hillsdale, 50 right now in uh, Adrian and we come a little farther south numbers very similar uh, down toward Van Buren and Fostoria but with a very dry atmosphere we expect these numbers to tumble quickly as we go into the rest of our evening let's go ahead and take a look at triple Doppler radar scanning through the Great Lakes we're in good shape here you can see these clouds continually erode especially as we get into later portions of the day and I expect that by eight nine o'clock won't be hardly a cloud in the sky if anything just a few high leftover clouds gonna see a lot of starshine overnight tonight we're gonna see a lot of sunshine tomorrow as high pressure briefly builds in ahead of this approaching system which we expect to come through the area as we go through Thursday night into very early on Thursday 52 right now in Toledo 50 down in Columbus some cooler numbers off to our north so this is a bit of a chilly air mass we're going to be stuck in here for yet another day here we are with our true view forecast going through tonight and into the day tomorrow clear skies we get into plenty of sunshine during the day tomorrow but it's not going to do much to warm us up still maybe some backwash clouds I like to call them from that system out to the east coast but the system approaching from the west is a very weak trough of low pressure in fact it doesn't have a lot in the way of moisture to work with and as we go through and into uh, very early on friday maybe even before sunrise that's when we expect to see maybe a couple of showers push into the area it's an equal chance that everyone stays dry for the first part of our friday once we get into friday afternoon we go partly sunny and things look pretty nice it's time to bring in our mbc 24 weather kid this is caleb wittenberg he is from lambertville michigan there you go see your name there your mbc 24 weather kid officially here caleb caleb is going to walk us through the rest of the forecast tonight so go ahead and take it away caleb what do you see up there Okay, tonight will be 36 degrees, clear skies, getting cooler. And here we go into tomorrow. Heading into tomorrow, 57 degrees, mostly sunny and still a bit cold. Now we got to walk through this extended forecast. Looks pretty nice for the upcoming weekend, doesn't it? Tomorrow is supposed to be cool, 57 degrees for the high, 36 degrees for the low. Heading into Friday, we have some isolated morning showers. The high is expected to be 61 and the low 42. That weekend looks pretty good. What do we see there next week, Caleb? Next week, the first batch of rain showers will come in Thursday, and it's supposed to be around... 60 degrees. Oh, very nicely done. Do you want to say hi to anybody out there at home? Who's Is there anybody watching out there in TV land you wanted to say hi with? Hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. Yeah, this kid knows how to set himself up for Christmas, doesn't he? Good job, Caleb. Appreciate it, man. Thanks for being here. If you want to get your kid signed up for the NBC24 Weather Kid, go to our website, NBC24.com. You'll find a link with all the information there. Thanks a lot, buddy. Nice job. Nice meeting your mom and dad, too. Jim, Laura, we'll take it back over to you.